confusion and mixed feelings among many parents across Long Island today as students in certain districts did not have to wear a mask to school today. News 12's Liz Burke, uh, Liz Burke reports. Today's start to the school day was unlike any other for certain school districts across Long Island. Several districts lifted the mask mandate after a New York judge ruled Monday that the state's mask mandate can't be enforced. With very little notice, parents had to make tough decisions for their children about mask wearing. Some say they were relieved when hearing the news. I think it was time to remove the masks. I think uh, the kids have had the masks on way too long as it is, and I'm not sure that uh, scientifically it made much sense. Chris Quiamvayo, who picks up his niece and nephew from Division Avenue High School in Levittown, says he disagrees with the removal of masks in schools. I don't think that's a good idea. There. I think they should mandate it still because of the Omicron virus. Here in Floral Park, the Suwanaka Central High School District was one of the districts to lift the mandate today, making it optional for students and staff to wear masks. Meantime, the neighboring Floral Park Belrose School District, just two miles away, kept the mandate in place. The Inconsistency and the mixed information is making for a very difficult time for everyone, especially kids. Psychiatrist Dr. Liot Jarkin has this piece of advice for parents in school districts that removed the mask mandate. Explain to them on a level that they can understand that things are changing and evolving with the pandemic. And even though we now might have an option, whereas before we didn't, we and our family feel comfortable in continuing to wear them. Well, we agree that now it's time for us to not have to wear them any longer. In Floral Park, Liz Burke, News 12, Long Island. And Dr. Jarkin also says we're all dealing with collective trauma because of the pandemic and kindness and patience can go a long way in trying to get through this trying time. So did you send your child to school with a mask today? We asked you that question on Twitter. 55% of people that responded said yes, 45% say no, but there's still time to weigh in. The poll is up on our new 12 Long Island Twitter page.